The problem is fire. It's very simple. We are seeing the effects of fire very differently than ever before for two very important reasons. There's a problem because the materials that are inside a structure are very different from when I was a kid. Today it's made out of acetate and foam and sponge rubber and synthetic materials. A lot of it petroleum distillates. When it catches on fire, it's a, it's a wicked fire. It burns hot and it builds fast. Here's another problem too. A building is engineered to the micron. Steel that is the absolute minimum is typically what's used and that's because of the cost of steel. But what that means is there's not a margin for error. So in the event that you have a fire and the fire lasts long enough and if it's hot enough the steel fails. At 1100 degrees it loses half of its structural integrity. But when you're engineered to the micron you can't give up half of your structural integrity. So the problem that we deal with is fire. The simple solution is Contigo. We do a couple of things very elegantly, uh, very cost efficiently, and very reliably. And that is, in the case of combustibles, we protect those combustibles so that fire can't get to the combustibles. Fire doubles every 60 seconds. But if it's not fed, it also starves very quickly. So the idea is just create a hard char barrier so that combustibles are protected. Fire can't get to it, fire can't grow, fire dies. In the case of structural steel, you want something that's going to be very thin, very pretty, very inobvious, but in the event of a fire, it's going to swell up and have a hard char barrier that's going to protect the steel from direct attack from flame, or high thermal energy. It's going to protect it from that so it doesn't weaken and then collapse. And that's what we do. The simple solution is protect the substrate. Another important thing that Contigo does very well is suppress smoke. For example, our UL723 on Douglas fir plywood, which is very flammable, is zero by zero. No flame spread, no smoke production. Nobody else does that. Here's why that's important. In the event of a fire, for every one person that dies from burn injuries, they died from being attacked by the fire itself, 50 die from smoke inhalation. Smoke is the killer. So that's another thing that we do well is suppressing smoke. The one thing I can tell you is I have yet to see an instance where Contigo does not deliver a superior level of protection and performance for significantly fewer dollars and less time. So in terms of a comparative value, not even getting into the health benefits of using a product that's very non-toxic compared to one that has stated toxicity issues, not even thinking about that, just the comparative value. What's it gonna cost me to use Contigo versus something else? When you do a point by point comparison, it becomes very obvious. You know, an important added value, people will tend to think about it in the beginning. An added value is that you're gonna run over budget. You always run over budget. So the value engineering people or the VE team always scrambling to, to find the answer. You know, where can we save some money? An added value with Contigo for the VE types is that you're gonna save a ton of money. The bigger the project, the more you save. That may solve your whole VE dilemma with one decision. It's an important value added. And I'll give you another one that a contractor shared with me, the reason they like Contigo so much. Their typical project is $120 million. So that's $10 million a month. And when they switched to Contigo, one of the big things they pointed out that I, I hadn't even thought of time because with other products they had to shut down they had to sequester the area they had to get people out of the way everything stopped and then when the trades came back in if anything went wrong they had to sequester it cordon it off get everybody out of there spray again contigo you just spray it so time and the one thing that John pointed out to me was he said look if I have to delay my project one month 
because of fireproofing, that is going to cost me $10 million. I won't get that month back. $10 million. A lot of people don't think about that. The time. Time is, in fact, as they say, money. And that's a big advantage that we have. The reason someone should care about Contigo is it's going to do a job that they all need to do. It's going to do it better. It's going to do it safer. It's going to do it for less. There are very usable products out there. But if something is if something is better and it's safer and it's easier and it's prettier and it costs less, why would you not do that?